In this episode of the King Snow What's Good product review, we are looking at the 2023 Nitro Dinghy Snowboard. The dinghy is a brand new shape for this season, designed for riders with bigger feet or experienced powder shredders and groomer carvers looking for a versatile shortboard experience. It has a directional tapered shape with true camber matched with a progressive side cut providing a fun surfy ride. It features Nitro's Power Core 2 with a reflex core profile, bilight laminates, and a sintered Speed Formula HD base. Here's what our tester had to say about the 2023 Nitro Dinghy Snowboard. I'm Cam, uh, the Whistler Black Home Train Park Supervisor, and I've been boarding for 27 years. I like to ride a little bit of everything. Not much of a jumper these days, but if there's pow, I'll send off just about anything. Love jibbing, land some deep trenches on the groomers. But my first impression of the board, love the color, real basic, really allows the board's shape to do the talking for it. I actually never ridden a board like this, so I wasn't really sure what to expect, but the first two laps, I was really blown away with how it drove into the turns and just like real long flowy carving and uh, the true camber really allows for the snappiness through the turns like when you're driving through you can really pop out springy and then uh, when you're boosting off rollers and stuff the tail like even though it is shorter it really has that pop you need. Uh, I was lucky enough to get like a 30 centimeter pow day on it which the name really reflects the board. You're just sitting on top of everything, cruising down, not having to worry about dropping the nose. The tighter turns seem to be happening the more I get used to the board and ride and switch, just like those quick little weaves. It is a little harder to get it up onto edge, but as soon as you get that board on edge, you are just driving through, just hang on. You got no problems when you're riding out at the end of the day through the chop. I was riding it like I ride all my other boards, trying to weave through all the moguls, but realized I'm on this and just powered through everything. When I've been ripping the side hits, I've noticed the responsiveness of the true camber, just the width, like you're so stable coming in. If there's like some bumps or anything, you can just spring off and you got no problems. If you're an intermediate advanced rider, uh, love slashing pow or boosting side hits, laying some deep trenches, this is the board for you.